Hi, I'm Blair Josie from Nexop US Dev Team. And today I will show you how to manage the split printing on Gastro, which is a module of Nexop US. Before we get started, I would like to remind you that some topics about the printing configuration has yet been covered. You might need to refer to this tutorial in order to have a better understanding of this one, okay? Well, the split printing on Gastro. What do you have to know? The split printing has been made for a restaurant which has a detailed kitchen architecture. What I mean by that is a restaurant where we have different kitchens which handle different type of food. Usually on each kitchen, there are a printer linked to it where only specific items are printed. So for example, for one order with a juice and a pizza, we should have the pizza printed on the printer of the kitchen responsible of the pizza and for the juice to his kitchen. Okay, that's what we're going to cover today. So let's get started. How to assign items to kitchens. The first step is to make sure that the system currently supports a multiple kitchen feature. This can be made from the store setting, which are different from the application settings. So let's click on store settings, then restaurant settings. The first column has an option to enable the multiple kitchens. For the option disable multiple kitchens, you must set no and save the settings. Okay. From the restaurant menu on the sidebar, you'll be able to see the kitchen's menu. This takes you to the kitchen list where you can basically create a kitchen. So we will create a new kitchen by clicking on add restaurant kitchen. Now let's just provide a name and select which category of item are handled by this kitchen. What does that mean? If you want a pizza to be printed on a printer linked to this category, then select the category pizza. And now all pizza will be shown on the kitchen receipt every time an order is placed. Okay. And finally, let's fill a description, but it's not required. You can repeat the process for all the kitchen that you want to create. Just be sure that your kitchens aren't handling the same categories. How to assign a printer to a kitchen. If you want to assign a printer to a kitchen, you need to connect either Nexo Print Server or Google Cloud Print your installation. Please refer to the tutorial about connecting printers to Gastro to know how that works. Now, all we have to do is to select how Gastro prints to the kitchen. So let's get to the restaurant settings, then print option. We have two options here. Single printer so that all incoming orders are printed on a single printer or kitchen printers so that all items are printed to the kitchen printer. On selected, let's save the settings. Now we should be able to see all created printers as a drop down menu which shows all available printers. You just have to assign the printers and save the settings. Now, every time that you are proceeding to an order, you should have a split receipt on each kitchen. Okay, that's all about configuring the split printing on Gastro. If you have any issue during the configuration, let us know. And thank you for watching this.